I got this question. It's a simple question, but it's a common question. How do you set up SBUS on your flight controller? I'm going nuts. I'm going to answer this question for the FPV model X Racer F303, which is the flight controller I have in this particular copter that I've got right here. But this is actually true for any of the flight controllers you might be using. The tricky thing is that you have to figure out which UART the receiver or S bus pin on the flight controller is mapped to. Uh, and so the, the flight controller has these chips on it called the UARTs. Uh, they handle the serial input and output. So communicating to the USB port, to the configurator GUI, if you have a Bluetooth adapter to your OSD, anything that the flight controller talks to via a digital serial interface goes through one of these UARTs. But you got to know what UART the SBUS pin is connected to. So here we have the pinout of the F303, and here's the SBUS pin. And oh, look, it's telling us right here, that's UART3. Now notice that this chip has three UARTs. Now, you, don't, you, you don't know that from just looking here, but we can see here's UART1, here's UART2, and then SBUS is UART3. So then if we go to Clean Flight and connect, I can show you in the ports tab, UART3 is set to Serial RX. And then I've got my receiver plugged in to that pin, which I'm not going to show you, but there it is. It's plugged in there. It's important that you not have anything else on this line, just the receiver. Serial receiver on UART3. Then I'm going to go to the configuration tab. And what I need to do is I need to choose RX Serial as my receiver mode, and then in the serial receiver provider, I need to select SBUS. Now, if you try to do this before you pick Serial RX, it will not work, it'll reset. So first you need to enable Serial X, Serial RX, then you need to save and reboot, then go to configuration after you've saved that, and choose RX Serial and SBUS, and save and reboot, and you should find that it takes, and then it should work in the receiver tab just fine. Now, just for your prerogative here, here is my video on clean flight pre made and check and final configuration. When I made this video, I was using the Luminaire Lux, not the F303. And if we look up at my, my ports tab, you can see that Serial RX is on UART 1 for that board. Okay. Again, you, you do not have the Serial RX connected to the UART 1 pins. I believe on the Luminaire Lux, you still have access to the UART 1, UART 2, and UART 3 pins, but then you also have a separate receiver pin. Okay, so so you can you could, if you wanted to, connect that receiver, I suppose, to UART 1 directly. Uh, I'm not sure why you would, but you could. So, so you have to know for the board that you're using what UART the serial receiver is mapped to internally. And hopefully you can find that in your documentation, but if you absolutely need to, you could probably just find it via trial and error. There are only so many UARTs. Okay, well, I hope that was helpful. I hope it was educational. And as always, happy flying.